Good, bad, good. I love that one. Oh my god, it's cool. Oh, I saw that. Ding a dergan. When we think of iPhone games, we don't usually think of games like Dungeon Hunter or NBA Live, but we think of casual and quick mini games like Tetris or Bejeweled. Dark Harvest is a perfect example of stereotypical iPhone games. And by stereotypical, I mean a short, quick, but fun little minigame perfect for on the bus or airplane. The objective and whole idea of the game is a bit abstract, but is unique. Forget what your parents told you. In this game, vegetables are pure evil, and you try to grow as many as you can to raise an army to rage war on everything good. You do this by playing the actual game, which consists mostly of launching chemical colored orbs into the sky to match them up with same colored orbs. Once you have joined three or more orbs of the same color, they disappear and new orbs start to appear. The game gets progressively harder as it throws numerous orbs into the play area and you must quickly decide where to throw your orb. It's not like I haven't seen this match 3 genre before, but this game practically puts you in a trance and the player becomes completely focused on it, which is a rare experience among many games. But if you're immune to this game's hypnotic spell, the developers added adventure mode, which you can grow veggies, and in quick play mode when you're pressed for time. There are also online leaderboards and Facebook integration, but nothing really else that sets this game apart from others of its type. It's a bittersweet experience for me, because the app doesn't offer a lot of variety in its gameplay, but it's fun while it lasts. The app is $1.99 in the App Store currently, and it's a bit high for a game like this, so you might have second thoughts about this one. I'm going to give this app 3 out of 5 stars. If you have any requests for what app I should review next, or you have created an app you'd like me to review, please leave a comment or video response below letting me know. I'm going to limit one request per person.